Hey, what's up guys? Have you ever heard somebody play a song and you asked yourself the question, what are all of those chords they're able to fit in between the basic chords of the song? Today, we're gonna to be talking about it. We're gonna to be talking about passing chords and passing chords that I find primarily in gospel music. However, music is music. And so you can apply this to whatever genre you like. Hey, check it out. Hey guys, this is Davin, and this video is the first video in a series where I'm going to be teaching about diminished passing chords. Uh, I'm going to be spending so much time on diminished passing chords because I think uh, it can go from really rudimentary to extremely complex, and I find that gospel musicians use these chords a whole lot in their playing. And so let us go ahead and dive right in. What is a passing chord? A passing chord is a chord used between two chords. So let's say I'm going from C to D minor. If I put a chord in between these two chords, that chord becomes my passing chord. This is what I mean. All right. There I used a passing chord to get to the D minor. Okay, so now I'm gonna play a song that you probably know, and I'm gonna play it in a very simple way, and then after that I'm gonna apply some diminished passing chords to it, okay? Now I'm going to apply some passing chords to it. All of those chords I use were diminished chords, okay? All right. So now let's talk about what is a diminished chord and how do you find it going to a minor chord? So a diminished chord is this. Um, play a C chord, all right? Go down a half step from the second note in the chord. That gives you C minor. Well, when you go down a half step from the fifth, or from the third note in the chord, that gives you C diminished, okay? And that's how you find a diminished chord. So now let's figure out how do you find a diminished chord when going to a minor chord in any key that you're in. This is what you're going to do. You're going to locate the minor chord that you're going to. So let's say we're in the key of C and we're going to go to an A minor. All right. Well, what we need to do is we need to find the major chord before it. So the major chord before A minor is G major. We need to take the root of the chord and go up a half step. The root of the chord is G, and we go up a half step to G sharp. That gives us our diminished chord going to the minor chord. So this is how you would do it. So let's do another example, just in case you missed that one. Let's say we're going to an E minor chord. You find the chord before it, which would be D. You take that root of the chord and you go up a half step. And that gives you your diminished chord going to the E minor chord. That gives you your passing chord, okay? All right. Um, just something I like to do for fun. I like to just practice diminished chords going to minor chords. Uh, something that would be like this. Uh, uh, you know, um, I actually practiced them using uh, diminished uh, half sevens, so it was a little awkward. Uh, something, it'd be like this. Uh... Uh, ooh, it's been a 
why. Alright, but you get the idea. Let me do it again. So there you have it. Um, start practicing that and then stay tuned for more videos where we dive further into diminished passing chords. Thanks so much for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. And don't forget to leave us a comment in the comment section below. I will see you in the next video. Remember this, great worship leaders are always learning.